The Caveman's Guide to the Dewey Decimal System by Grandview Library. In 1873, Melville Dewey devised a system of classifying books which is still used in many libraries today. He chose certain main subjects and numbers so that all nonfiction books on the same subject would be together on the shelf. Dewey's system, known as the Dewey Decimal Classification, is the most widely used library organization system in the world. It works like this. All books are grouped by topic. There are 10 basic categories, and each of those categories is subdivided into 10 more categories, and so on. So, how did Dewey decide on the 10 categories? Easy! He imagined that he was a caveman and asked himself the kind of questions he thought a caveman would have asked. First question. What do I need to know before I begin? These are general kinds of things, the kind of information that would be found in encyclopedias and other reference books. The books that answer these kind of questions can be found in the 000s of the Dewey Decimal System. Okay, who am I? Questioning who you are, how you feel, and what you think falls in the area of philosophy and psychology. These kinds of books are in the 100s area of the Dewey Decimal System. Who made me? Questions about God found in books of religion and mythology are located in the 200 section of nonfiction. Who is that man or woman in the next cave? When man thinks about other people, it's called social science. This includes economics, government, careers, holidays, and even fairy tales. These kinds of subjects are all found in the 300s area of the Dewey Decimal System. Now that I know who I am and who they are, how can I make that man understand me? Language allows people to communicate with each other using words. You'll find books on languages in the 400s, including foreign language books and grammar and usage books too. How can I understand nature and the world around me? Natural science is the study of the land, sea, and sky. You'll find books about math, planets, weather, deserts, wetlands, wild animals, and bugs in the 500 section of the Dewey Decimal System. How can I use what I know about nature? Answering this question requires applying what you've learned along the way. Dewey called this the Applied Science and Useful Arts. Topics found in the 600s include books about weapons, cars, medicine, farming, cooking, building, and technology. Phew! Enough work! How can I enjoy my leisure time? If you are looking for books about drawing pictures, painting, music, dancing, or playing games, then head straight for the 700 shelves of the Dewey Decimal System. How can I pass my stories on to my children and grandchildren? As man created fables, poetry, plays, and other works of fiction, they were eventually recorded for everyone to read. In our library, you will only find plays and poetry in the literature, or 800s, section of the nonfiction area. All of the other literature is located in fiction or the picture book sections of our library. How can I leave a record for men of the future? History, geography, and biography tell the story of events, places, and people that have impacted the world. You'll find all these books in the 900 section of the Dewey Decimal System.